Well, this is we're at the town of Bluemont doing a brief reenactment of a very small engagement between Mosby's men and some members of the 6th Virginia Cavalry and the 1st New York Cavalry, I think it was. And it's just a day event. I think it's part of Bluemont's Heritage Days, and we're just part of the show today. My name is Rob Bruno. I reenact the 1st Maryland Cavalry. Uh, I got started about 17 years ago. There, there's a lot of parts that are that I would say are, are my favorite. Seeing towns like this that are somewhat time forgot, so it's a, it gives you a good glimpse of what life was like in the mid 1800s. So visiting places, historic places like this, is certainly a highlight for me doing this. Um, part of it again is just trying to understand a culture and a time period that's so different than our 21st century life. So the highlight for me is those kind of little experiences that just give you a glimpse into the 1860s. And it's good to be out around good people and um, talk horses. Obviously we're all horsemen here, so just listen to how we work with our individual horses and giving each other's tips and, you know, to work with horses. Just the learning experience of being around other good people and, and uh, you know, the camp life is, is also, I really enjoy that because, again, it's just so different from our modern lives. Um, the, the way this battle supposedly happened is the federal troops that were in the town were surprised by somewhat of a detachment of a couple different groups, again some of Mosby's men, some of the 6th Virginia um, who were on leave, and they somewhat got surprised in the town. And according to one report, um, or I should say that the two different reports show a little bit different event depending on the perspective, but supposedly that the Confederates came in and, and ran the Federals out of town. Um, the federal version, it was a little bit more of a battle, uh, but basically they chased them out of Bluemont back down the Snickersville Turnpike for a while before they kind of gave up the chase. But if, from what I understand, it was sort of a quick engagement and ended up being a running, a running, um, a running contest.